Just as communities began recovering from last week's rainfall, storms will continue to make their way through Massachusetts and Connecticut. 22 News reporter Melissa Torres is live in the studio with a closer look at how widespread flooding is impacting local communities. Well, very heavy rainfall fell across western Massachusetts this weekend, which led to flash flooding. Just this morning over in Thompsonville, Connecticut, water levels were very high. There was lots of debris and waste in the water, making it incredibly murky. Significant and widespread flooding along the river can be expected from the Massachusetts towns of Agawam and Longmeadow through the northern Connecticut towns of Suffield and Enfield. This widespread flooding impacts low-lying areas along the Connecticut River. Lowland flooding will begin along the Connecticut River near Thompsonville. That last year and the year before, we were in heavy droughts, like 20 feet below. You showed the reservoirs and all this other stuff, and they were way below. You could see where the market levels were, and the water was down. You've seen the bottoms of stuff and legend and different things like that. Now we're way above. In the next three or four days of rain, if it's going up north, we're going to have the same problem. They're going to open up the floodgates. According to the 22 News Storm Team, area rivers are below flood stage right now, but they are still running high and fast. And with more rain on the way, it's important to take the necessary precautions to not only protect yourself, but your home from potential flooding by having sump pumps to set up in your basement to prevent any water damage. Working for you, Melissa Torres, 22 News.